eyes in the sky for the army. This army unit was on a mission. The soldiers had noticed a lot of rural folk moving about. Their basic instinct should have been to find out why there was such an unusual movement of rural folk. But I suppose they might have been focused on protecting the people. They totally missed the terrorists who had taken cover among and behind the rural folk. Ultimately, a double dozen soldiers were killed in the ambush. This didn't happen a decade back. It happened just this year. In India, in Sukma, in the age of the drones. This could well have been prevented and the precious lives of the soldiers could have been saved by the use of this very simple device. You all know it. Why then did the Indian Army not use it? Did the Defence Ministry ever raise an issue and discuss regarding this? Do we actually need more tech savvy experts as heads at various levels of the Indian Army? Is there a process to identify, promote and appoint combat experts who are also tech ex experts? Because in the coming era, war will be fought with technology. Technologically advanced systems require tech experts to lead them. Aerial monitoring by drones could have done the trick. No need of satellite imagery, sophisticated weaponry or costly surveillance equipment. Just a few, few well-placed drones could have given them the location, the movement, the terrain and the near local environment. A very simple idea, but an idea worth more than a million bucks because increasing use of drones in the military can save lives. At the LOC, can drones give advance warning? Drones can be used to protect international borders, movement of terrorists and enemies will time. Drones can be placed at strategic and required points and ahead of patrol. The drones are like eyes that can go anywhere. They are highly penetrative. In nooks and corners that are not visible to the human eye. In twilight and in darkness. And 24 bar 7 which again is not humanly possible. Drones can be used in search and find, ambush and desanitization operations and in local, urban and border locations. I hope drones are being used in all such situations in the Indian Army. We have not seen them and if they are not, then they should be. Mr. Narendra Modi cannot be everywhere. We have to take decisions at our levels. Eyes in the sky, drones for the military.